The Belarusian Popular Front Renaissance BPF Belarusian Belaruski Narodny Front Adrajin. BNF was a social and political movement in Belarus in late 1980s and the 1990s which led Belarus to its independence from the Soviet Union. It was similar to the Popular Fronts of Latvia and Estonia, and the Sajudis movement in the Republic of Lithuania. Creation The Belarusian Popular Front was established in 1989, following the examples of the Popular Fronts in the Baltic states. Its founding conference had to be organized in Vilnius because of pressure from the authorities of the Belarusian SSR. Initially, the Popular Front was uniting numerous minor organizations promoting the Belarusian language and history. However, soon the movement began voicing political demands, supporting the perestroika and democratization in the Soviet Union which would enable a Belarusian national revival. The Popular Front was the first political organization in Belarus to openly oppose the Communist Party of Byelorussia. The prominent Belarusian writer Vasil Baikow became an active member of the Belarusian Popular Front. Writer Ailes Adamovich was an active supporter of the Popular Front. The front had about 10,000 activists in different regions of Belarus as well as in Moscow, Vilnius, and Riga. It published a newspaper, Adrajin, News of the Belarusian Popular Front. Renaissance. Among the significant achievements of the front was the uncovering of the burial site of Karapati near Minsk, a major NKVD mass extermination sites of Soviet political prisoners in the 1930s. The Belarusian Popular Front actively protested against Soviet policies following the Chernobyl accident, after which a large territory of Belarus was contaminated by nuclear fallout. The Belarusian Popular Front in the Parliament of Belarus In May 1990, 37 members of the Belarusian Popular Front were elected into the 12th Belarusian Supreme Council and formed a dynamic opposition group in the parliament of the then Soviet-controlled Belarusian Soviet Socialist Republic. In July 1990, the Belarusian Popular Front initiated the passing of the Declaration of State Sovereignty of the Belarusian Soviet Socialist Republic. In August 1991, following the 1991 Soviet coup d'état attempt and supported by tens of thousands of protesters outside the parliament building, the Belarusian Popular Front has managed to convince the Supreme Soviet to declare full independence of Belarus from the USSR. The historical Belarusian national symbols, the white-red-white -white flag and the Pahonia coat of arms were restored as state symbols of Belarus. Opposition to the regime of Alexander Lukashenko In 1994, Alexander Lukashenko was elected president of Belarus. From the very beginning, the Belarusian Popular Front became one of the main political forces opposing President Lukashenko. In 1994 the BPF formed a shadow cabinet consisting of 100 BPF intellectuals. In 1995, members of parliament from the Belarusian Popular Front went on a hunger strike as a protest against Lukashenko's controversial referendum to replace state symbols by slightly amended Soviet ones and to make Russian language official in Belarus. The hunger strike was violently interrupted by police forces who beat up the members of parliament. In 1996, the Belarusian Popular Front was one of the main powers behind mass protests against Lukashenko's policies of Russification and integration with Russia, as well as against his second controversial referendum amending the constitution in a way to concentrate power in the president's hands. The protests were violently dispersed by the police. Two leaders of the Belarusian Popular Front, Zyanon Pozniak and Sherhei Navyumchik, have fled the country and received political asylum in the United States. <laughs> Split In the late 1990s the Belarusian Popular Front split in two rivaling organizations. Its conservative wing under the exiled leader Zyanon Pozniak formed the Conservative Christian Party, BPF BNF, while the moderate majority formed the BPF Party Partia BNF, Partia BNF led by Vinchik Vyakorka. Both parties claim to be the only legitimate successor of the Belarusian Popular Front established in 1989. The Malady Front, formerly the Popular Front's youth organization, has also become an autonomous organization. 
In 2011, following an internal conflict, more than 90 further members left BPF party, including several prominent veterans of the original Belarusian Popular Front, such as Lyevan Barshevsky, Juri Chadaika, Vinchik Vyakorka. This was sometimes described as a second split of the Belarusian Popular Front. Formally, the Belarusian Popular Front continues to exist as an NGO affiliated with the BPF party. Topic. Notable former members Vasil Baikow, writer, Nobel Prize nominee Raihor Barajalan, poet and writer, Nobel Prize nominee Sherhe Navyumchik, vice president of the Rada of the Belarusian Democratic Republic in exile Ailes Bialyatsky, human rights activist and political prisoner Piotr Sadowski, first ambassador of Belarus to Germany Paval Sivierinyes, Christian Democratic politician and political prisoner Jowian Kulik, graphic designer, author of The Code of Arms of Belarus adopted in 1991 Uladimir Arlu, writer Yaugen Shatokin, artist Topic. See also People's Movement of Ukraine Popular Front of Latvia Popular Front of Estonia Sajudis Topic. References Topic. External links The Belarusian Popular Front in 1988-1996, photo and video Narodny Front Photogistoria Zimagana i Paramogli The People's Front Photo History of Struggle and Victory.